You ever wonder how the wax from a dead out hive like this, this gross, yucky, smelly stuff, is converted into wax that's used for many purposes? Well, stay tuned. We're going to show you next at Triple T Bee Farm. So there's several components to a solar wax melter. There's a pan. We put a little bit of water in the pan to stop the wax from getting all stuck to it. There's an outer box that I just made out of scrap wood. And then there's an inner box that has a screen on it. And that is where you put the unrendered wax. And there is a piece of glass that goes over the top of it to keep bees and other insects out while it melts. So I'm using gloves, not the puncture resistant gloves, but just some gloves because this is going to be full of bee parts, wax, nectar, pollen, all kinds of stuff. So I know some people say to take and crush it down as much as you can. This is my first attempt, so I'm just going to throw a bunch of this in there and see what happens. Just let her rip. It's a good thing there's not such a thing as smell vision on YouTube because this stuff smells pretty doggone nasty. So I think that's a good start. We'll see what happens. We'll come back later and uh, check it out. So I went ahead and moved the solar wax melter up in a different spot in our yard. I've had it out here for several days with 80 degree plus temperatures and plenty of sun. And it's really done not a whole lot of anything. So I'm not sure if it's because the wax is the brood nest wax that has a lot of cocoons in it and other things or if it just doesn't get hot enough or that I'm just not patient enough so um, the nice pure wax that you see there that um, that comes out of the honey supers that we just have a double boiler we use inside the house for that um, but I was just trying to figure out a way to get this nasty wax rendered so I think I'll have to come up with a different way stay tuned we'll see what I do so it's good Probably three hours later and my beautiful bride went ahead and stirred this stuff up and it does look like maybe it's melting a little bit I wanted to get up here and show you that the uh, honeycomb wax from the honey super see a little bit of it down there that actually did start to melt and I suspect it is because of the other things that are in that wax that wax was very difficult to remove from the frames it was took a lot of scraping so not an expert just trying to learn so we'll catch you on the flip side Triple T Bee Farm, a place of great charm Where honeybees thrive and the hives swarm With plenty of flowers and fields of delight